let's quickly talk about something a customer was asking about this morning. So he says, and I think this is very interesting because I think we have a lot of people that are on the newer side of starting an agency. Maybe they've never done it. Maybe they're completely just getting started and haven't done anything online like this. But he says his biggest issue, his biggest pain point right now at the moment is finding a way to actually provide value to a customer, right? But I think what he means is how to sell the value of what he would provide as an AI automation agency or to a customer. And he says, I don't see how someone would pay you a good amount of money by just offering them an AI chat bot, even if it's personalized to their business. He thinks it needs to be combined with something more like lead generation, social media growth, something like that. This is something we keep seeing with the customers, which is they're not as familiar with selling. Like, why do business owners, why will they pay for an AI chatbot? It's... And further, I think that our customers, like you said, they're not as familiar with sales, but I think the SMBs in many ways, like they don't realize that even though they think it's easy to go and create an AI chatbot and then mani manipulate the prompt to make it appropriate for a business, it won't be easy for the business owners to do it. No, they have no not. familiarity with prompting. They don't even want to go in there and do it. They literally just want to have a meeting with you. They, they want don't to even, get the end results all. Yeah. And they don't even want to do their website. That's why people manage things like Wix for business yep. owners, because even though Wix and all those examples are the simplest and easiest drag and drop builder website you could possibly imagine, people are still using agencies to build Wix websites for their business and manage the, the website for their, because as we know, business owners mm -hmm. only care about their business. They don't care about the other things that they should care about. But when you're focused on your craft or your art or your passion or whatever it may be, that's why they're small business owners. They had a passion, yeah. they saw a problem, they something, and then they wanted to make some money by solving that problem or doing that thing or selling that thing. Once you get to a higher level of, ex of sales experience, talking to larger companies who don't assess purchases on an emotional level and assess it on a financial level, that completely changes the conversation to where you can use something like a profit calculator to show clearly to a business, here's the amount of money that you could save by using our thing. And by doing so, I'm going to charge you a percentage of that savings. That makes complete sense to me.